You're still collapsing to the side. Yeah. You're still collapsing to the side. So, I mean, look, I mean, it's, it's very simple. You're making it harder than it needs to be. I mean, it's just this. Look. Look, look behind you. There's close. You hit. You always, you always break your form. You do this, and then all of a sudden you go like this. Yeah. You know, Keep that arm straight. Tuck your head. See this? See here? See this? Look. I can see the dog crap. Yeah, behind look you. back behind you. <laughs> <laughs> look back behind you. That's the cat. Use your okay. momentum to take you. Oh, okay. cat. See, you always do this, and then you turn. You always right do the this, and then you go like this. See, you. Don't tuck your hand. Go straight. Okay, get up there. There you go. You see what I'm saying? But when you're able to come this young and try to, you know, teach and take charge, like Rick said, that's how you're going to be in the ring. You're confident that you're going to call something and they're going to do it. You know what I mean? Well, it helps a lot. It, it'll, it'll give you a whole different view of, of the business. Well, I told you, we'll divide the classes up and each person takes a segment or takes a class and teaches it because it gives you leadership. And you've done this before. Mm -hmm. So when you're, and Billy's doing it today, when you, when you take leadership in the class, then you get in the ring, you have leadership in the ring. You get more confidence. You've got so much better just lately. You know that. Yeah, I'm just gonna watching turn, from Look at him turn red. Right, <laughs> <laughs> right, because right, I'm the brown, 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 red, red and brown. And I think he's blessed. Yeah. I'm just sitting over there, man, and I see you had bumps are good. Bumps are good, man. I saw that no hand bump, nip bumps. YouTube. Nope. Ask him where he learned Old it. school tapes. Nope. Ask him where he learned it. Didn't they? Hey, <laughs> you think Billy gets kicks, man? Billy, where did you learn those moves? Uh, Virtual Fire 5. Video games. <laughs> <laughs> but they were. Where did, hey, but where did the video games learn those? Wrestling. Right. Exactly. Yeah. 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 All goes back. <laughs> yeah. Alright, who's up? make yours look good and it's my turn to give you something and you make mine look like shit, I'll be like, okay, you know, now you're pissing me off, you know what I mean? Give and take. You know, you gotta give and take. He just made you make look like a million dollars with all these bumps that he did. That's why when you're not ready, you're blown up, hold there for a while. Breathe before you go back to the spot. Because two things, first thing, you'll get hurt because you're blown up. Second, it'll look like that. Like, you're not, you know it's coming, feed him, jump, you know. Give him your arm, lead with that arm. What'd you say? And, and don't and don't like when you when you over here, right? When you're doing the when you're doing the, the uh, elbows, right? Elbow, right? Right. And then you just kind of went like this, kind of push it back. Make it believable. Make it believable. Make it believable, right? And then uh, 
don't go when, when he was giving you the elbow. Don't go against the ropes right away. You know, you know, sell it, sell it because you went know, elbow, elbow, and you lean into the ropes. He's still hitting you. So let him, let him, you know, let him at least a couple times to sell it, and then don't, don't, don't go for that. As long as we're picking it apart, <laughs> dude, it's not your move to go. It's his move. Whoever's pushing you, or if you give him the elbow, you, it's your turn when you want to go. If I'm the one taking it, I'm not going nowhere until, until you push you. me. It's your move. You're the director. I'm not going to just like lean and drop on the ropes. A lot of people do that. You just gave it away. Because you don't know you're doing it. People watching, like, why is he backing up in the rope? He just gave it away. You know, oh. and so many guys do that. They'll back to the ropes. They'll look behind them where they're going. The guy should be forcing you back. He's pushing you back. You're trying to resist all the way. you you got to exactly. push it back in there. When you hit his arm, forearm, and a lot of you guys are doing, so you're doing punches, you're, you're right here. You just bring him way back. Telegraph him. Right? You got to see him way on the back row. Bring him way don't back do it and hold him. And then, bam, then hit him there. Or don't do it at all. Otherwise, it'll look like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. I do it. If you ain't going to make it look good. If not, just do that. If you know your punches are like weak, you know, you feel like you're down in your get the elbow. And at least when you stop, it'll make it feel like it's something. Yeah. But if you just like, like you're thinking, you can think like this while you have them in the hole. You know? Because there are a lot of different ways. It's funny because there were some guys that were developmental camp that was with us on tour. And the old school guys were, were doing a, a clinic. And old school was totally different from what they're teaching now in WWE. Like, come on. Like right now when they're shooting people at WWE, when on a headlock, you know, old school, they, they work them, right? Or whatever. When they shoot them, they, they do this whole thing like this. Like when they're ready to shoot them, they want to go like this. Then. So if you see in WWE, the new guys coming in, they put their hand this way. That's her teaching. But it's, it doesn't hurt for you guys to learn. You guys will get there to, that at least you will know what they're talking about, you know. So there's a different style as they move. Before, the old school's like, boom, maybe like shoot you from there, you know, huh? Yep. Or grab your hair and... Or actually, if, if not there, they'll do they'll, 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 they'll take the trunks. Yeah. They'll take, they'll take the trunks and they'll shove you up that way, not pull the trunks, which is illegal in our real camp. But yeah, people. Hey, he's got the trunks. They yeah. got this. They got this whole thing now. Well, I was like, I watched them while they were teaching it. They got this whole thing where they push them. They couldn't. They couldn't even do this. They wanted them to go like this, straight on. Like, and then when they push them, in old school, they shoot them off and they'll turn like crazy. Boom! Yeah, right. The timing that right is there, perfect. That's all psychology. Yeah. yeah. But you, but you, but you're also saying that when you shoot them off, you're here. And I told you guys, and Reno told you. When you shoot him off, take two steps with him. And then so by, by the time you got him there and he turns around and you're raising up, even if you don't fall, it's like, whoa. Yeah, it's like, yeah. so I go like this. Here. Yeah, it's like here. a little bit off balance thing. Boom. Yeah. Of course, because that's your momentum. You're pushing in the goal. And then you're tripping. That's what I do. I keep my eye up. When I shoot somebody, I'm like this. And my eyes, I'm not looking at them. Here I go up. But I see a lot of guys do this, though. They shoot them off. And they, they stand straight up and they wait here and they're like... You know why? Because they wait and they and they almost like they're going to charge him. They're going to charge him and do what? Yeah, exactly. What are you going to do when you charge him?